Hey data visualization fans, Jack Wallen here to help you get things done. Let's find out how to connect your new Grafana system to a remote MySQL data source. Log into your MySQL server and open the MySQL configuration file with sudo nano slash etsy slash mysql slash mysql.conf.d slash mysql.cnf. In that file, look for the line bind dash address equals 127.0.0.1. Change that to bind dash address equals 0.0.0.0. Save and close the file. Restart the MySQL service with sudo system control restart MySQL. Next, we need to create a new user and give it the correct permissions. Log into the MySQL console with sudo mysql u root p. Create a new user with Create user, quote, Grafana reader, quote, identified by, quote, P word, quote, semicolon, where P word is a strong, unique password for the new user. Now we can grant that new user the select permission for the database with grant select on db dot star to, quote, Grafana reader, quote, semicolon, where db is the name of the database to be read by Grafana. Flush the privileges and exit from the MySQL console with flush privileges semicolon exit. Log into your Grafana instance and click the gear icon in the left sidebar. From the resulting pop-up, click data sources. In the next window, scroll down and select MySQL from the listing. You will then be presented with the necessary configuration options for a MySQL data connection. Here's what you must fill out. Host the IP address or domain of the MySQL hosting server, along with the port used for the database server. The default is 3306. Database, the database to be used as a source. User, Grafana Reader. Password, P word used to create Grafana Reader in the MySQL console. Configure those options and click Save and Test. You should eventually see Database Connection OK, indicating your data source is ready to go. <laughs> If you want to see more how-to videos, subscribe to our How to Make Tech Work YouTube channel. Also, check out Tech Republic for the latest news in tech.